Hey guys, this is Danny again. Uh, in this video, I'll be showing you, you know, how to set the setting for door auto lock, unlock, you know, uh, how to get the alert for the road traffic jams. If there is any speed camera, then whether you should be notified of that or not. So things like that, I'll be explaining on this video. So please keep watch my video and please kindly subscribe so that it will motivate me um, to make more videos. So firstly, let's go to the Toyota app. So this is the app where we have to go. So I go to the Toyota app, then I go to the settings. Um, here you get the personal information things. You can change the name. Then the, you, you can see the list of the devices connected here. And then you can see the general information here like when i you can see when i touching the screen i can see the sort of the beep sound so if you want to turn off you can just turn off from here you know um, and then you can see other is the daytime time so you can change here the format the 24 hour or 12 hour time and then you know if you want to have sort of a memorized keyword which means it's going to remember your last you know whatever uh, sort of um, things you have typed then another one you if you want to uh, see the trip info in kilometer liter or uh, liter kilometer as you see uh, in my screen you know here it is showing like you know a kilometer per liter because i have uh, changed the settings to kilometer per liter uh, if you want to so you know um, for the 100 kilometer how many liters of fuel you're using then i uh, advise you to use this setting go with these settings um so here and then another one is the display in this display you know um when you want to control the brightness and the display going to be automatic you know there is simply the brightness of cameras which is not pretty i think important so that's why i'm not i'm just skipping this one i'll mainly take you um to the main important part you know um this is for the system volume for the navigation you know navigation during the calls then this is for the media display cover art if you want to see the name of the you know uh, like um who is the uh singer of the song the another one is navigation very important guys this one all right so now here you can see the short traffic jam flow so if you're driving you know and if there is some sort of traffic after 500 meter or one kilometer then this enable option will you warn about that you know um you can you have the option of so brief free traffic flows which i believe um that is not required if some sort of incident has happened on the road um then you can turn on this one and that will give you the warning that some sort of accident or road blockage things have been happen and then again um you can have the um, um 3d settings so these things are pretty simple you know um and then again if you go to the route you know um you have a, some sort of you know uh, avoid traffic like in manual you know in a petrol uh, station suggestions on the way if there is any petrol another one very important the guidance guys if the map needs to be automatically zoom in zoom out and another thing a speed limit if there is a speed sign and if you want to get warned about the speed limits then this option you must turn on this option the another one a speed camera in australia we have lots of uh, what's called a speed camera and people getting fined so i believe um this should be always on and audible so when you drive in the freeway or any sort of high space then it should warn you you know uh, it will give you warning uh, or it will inform you pre-inform you that there is a speed camera uh, and then similarly guide with their street names where the warning if there is any fire or flood any things like that you will get the warning when you start driving the car or go close by to the that uh, warning area you know and then similarly guide with the traffic jumps and things like that map update which is not important for us uh, we don't bother much and then another one is other here is which things you know delete the recent trips things like that um which we really um don't need it you know and um, the another one is the vehicle customized you know and um, so lights so when you uh start or sit in the car the lights get auto on and then again it's got auto off so you have option to you know change these settings you know where you want to change the auto timer off or what could be the like 15 seconds 13 seconds then similarly for the door control now um uh, so what happening in my car is when my car goes above 20 kilometer um, uh, something like that i think 10 20 kilometer i believe and then the door gets locked now um if you want don't want the car door locked by a speed and if you want by p it means when i move my um, accelerator from drive to p the door should be um, auto lock you know sip from p it means if i'm moving from p to drive or any then the door should be locked so um if you uh, go with this option then that will enable that setting another one door auto unlock so now if you shift to p uh, if you have uh, selected the first option it means if and if you're driving and you press stop on the way or somewhere parked and if you um moved your clothes to p then the door will be auto unlock but i have preferred by the um by driver door it means even if i have parked the car uh if i don't unlock the car uh, my passenger or my back of the you know um, um car passengers cannot open the um, door so these sort of settings another one is the climate all right so the ac mode with the auto as you can see um this 
um, auto is working so um, you have um, this sort of um, these settings enable efficient ventilation mode you know so uh, when this is uh, on uh, it will automatic make on and on for the ventilation for the flow of the air and then similarly there is auto so the vehicle suggestion is on if there's some sort of other suggestions you know like um, you you want it then um, you can just do on here so that's fine and so this is guys the basic settings which wanna which we can do from our side you know and we don't have to rely on the um our you know dealer or we don't have to feel like you know how to do this this is pretty you know simple so again guys i'll make another video about how the you know 360 camera works how we can uh, view the underground you know the floor you know and please please kindly subscribe my video so that i'll make more video for you guys and keep motivating me all right thanks guys have a good day bye bye